Hey everyone, it's Jess with Small Town Crafty Gal, and I wanted to share with you today two hauls that I just did. There's some major sales going on at Michael's and at Hobby Lobby. Um, with Hobby Lobby, it was Paper Studios was 50% off, and I took advantage of that, considering they have a lot of stuff. Um, paper, well, Paper Studios sells a lot of stuff. And uh, I didn't really, my intentions weren't to go for uh, any Paper Studios. It was actually, all I wanted to do was get some, um, uh, what do you call it? Let's look, because they're right here in my hand. Uh, closure handles. And it's for a project I've been working on, and I decided that I wanted to do those closures instead of the ribbon, because the ribbon just didn't look right. So, uh, I got suckered in because things were 50% off, and I bought this Stargazer paper, which rung up for $9.99 instead of $20 today. And there's 60 sheets, um, 20 designers, 3 of each, as you can read right there and there's foil and I was inspired by what was her name scrap queen I believe she did a huge folio I think it was and she did I want to say it was graphic 45 maybe it wasn't I'll have to double check my sources on that but it was a galaxy um, type of paper it was either Maybe it was Prima. We'll go with Prima. Because they have that type of abstract. Well, yeah. Anyways. So, um, you can obviously see the different patterns that they have in this collection. I don't have scissors. I am recording from my car because it's a lot more peaceful out here right now. So, I would do a quick flip through for some of these. It does seem pretty dark. Because I don't have the light on. I think the... Yep. On this page, you can see that the unicorns are foil. And... Here's a couple other pages. Some moons. I think the moons are foil as well. Yep. As you can see. As soon as it goes back in focus... Come on. There it goes. That's my favorite. It's the teal that goes into the purple. Like a gradient. The stars are also foil. I'm pretty sure anything with the black and silver is the foil. The moons. It's another pretty. More galaxy. Ooh, I like this. It's like marble. Is it shiny too? Yep. It's shiny as well. Some natural light in here and more galaxies and more foil so there was that and then I got the closures I was talking about and was that it for I said I got something else oh yep here we go tassels I wanted to get tassels so I can make some more earrings. I got into jewelry making here and charm making and I really like the tassel earring idea. So I'm spending like, I don't know, five, six bucks for some at the store. Just make my own the way I want with my own beads. So that was my Hobby Lobby haul. And now I will share with you the Michaels haul. So the intentions on my Michaels haul was to go find those clasps because I thought Tim Holtz made them and I didn't see them because I was wrong. So I got suckered into buying some storage which I believe their storage is all 70% off. So this originally was eight bucks. I got it for three something and it's for washi. I don't have a lot of washi but I figured I needed something so I can see what I have. I have this bad uh, habit of just putting stuff in a box and putting it away so out of sight out of mind and at least this will still be in a box <laughs> but I'll be able to see what types of washies that I have so I can you know be a little bit more creative on my projects then I raided their $2 bin and 
I was looking for some inks. I really wasn't going to buy any because I'm not really inking anything right now, per se, like cards. But I came across these. Oops. And they are by Craftsmart. I will definitely, um, when I make my card that I plan on using this for, I'll definitely give like a little review on these. Because I know inks can be kind of funny, especially the cheaper ones. You pay for what you get, in my opinion, when it comes to inks or markers. So, there's, there's two different colors. A dollar piece. Then, also by the dollar bin, I got some butterflies, another set of butterflies, these were on, there was a bunch of stuff on clearance, I don't know if they're cleaning it out, getting ready for, I don't know, I guess summer, maybe they're getting ready for fall, who knows how quick they start stuff, I'm just kidding, but they had a bunch of these on sale. And these, I couldn't make up my mind. I sat here and I debated and debated. Do I want these? What would I use them for? They're pretty. I should get them even if I'm not going to use them because they're pretty. I'm just kidding. I do plan on using these. They're like iridescent. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Sequin flowers. They're super gorgeous. I love them. I would definitely make some tags or something with these or little embellishments or just keep them as they are and put them on some paper clips. Last but not least, I needed these so bad. I went through and I could not find any of these in my stash. The little brads to make little uh, closures with. So that is it guys. That is my Michaels and Hobby Lobby haul. If you guys have any questions or want um, any numbers off of these items of where I found them or have any questions, just leave them down below. Thanks for watching. Bye.